right, it is right about time to start. Hello, everyone. My name is Kara Moncrief, and I am the Clinical Communications Director for uh, Sinclair Viora. And today, super excited because we're going to go through the Premay, which is our newest technology that we just launched at our last Beauty Boss in Las Vegas. Um, so we will we'll, we will go through it and. If you don't already have a Prime, um, I think this will be really helpful. And then if you already do own a Prime, I'm not going to go through like full techniques, but I'm going to show videos. I'm going to talk about the techniques and the technology. Um, but if you ever need more, of course, you can always reach out to us uh, at the clinical department and we can help you with that. Uh, so I am going to share my screen. Let me get my PowerPoint pulled up. All right, now let me just move my toolbar here, make sure my video is pinned. All right. Okay, here we go. Um, okay, so here is a picture of the Prime, and it comes with five technologies, which we are going to break down uh, one by one. So first, I just want to play this video as an overview. I really hope the sound is working on these. Um, if not, you'll get to see the visuals, um, but I'm pretty sure the sound works well. Prime Dermafacial, the world's most advanced aesthetic facial device with five powerful technologies. The integrated data capture system helps you understand your practice, your customer's skin journey, and global trends, all from one device, transforming your business and customer experience like never before. Okay, so you can kind of see the technologies and we are gonna break those down one by one. Okay, so everything that the Prime Dermafacial treats, aging skin, so think uh, wrinkles, laxity, fine lines, textural, because uh, when we age, it's not just fine lines and wrinkles. If you really look at the skin closely, we typically have a lot of textural issues as well. Um, it's great for blemish um, prone skin, so, teenage or hormonal adult acne, uh, skin texture irregular, irregularities, so larger pores when, um, when people have really oily skin, that means that they have enlarged pores because all of that oil is built in the, the pore area and it stretches the pore size. Uh, so it really helps with pore size and then um, post acne or just controlling sebum in general, controlling uh, the dead skin that we start to accumulate on the surface of the skin really is the, the biggest problem for acne. Well, really it's, it's two problems. One, it's the buildup of dead skin cells. And then two, it's the um, overproduction of our sebaceous glands. So we're able to target both of those things so we can really control acne well. Uh, pigmentation, so think like uh, sun damage, solar lentigo, um, or pigment that is related to hormonal issues like melasma, which is one of the hardest things to treat. And because the system is um, more gentle in nature, you can safely go in to treat melasma where if you were using um, light-based technologies like lasers, you have to be really careful when going in to treat hormonal uh, pigmentation. And then dull complexion, which it really shines with this, especially right after the treatment. This is something that they can get done like on a Friday or if you're open on a Saturday and their skin is just glowing, they look really healthy. Um, so it really helps with that dull complexion. So dehydration, it's phenomenal for, uh, especially for places um, like where I live, Las Vegas or in the desert. But of course it's winter right now. So I think all of us probably are suffering from that dry skin, dehydration. Um, and then all of us are exposed to pollution, um, unfortunately. Uh, the free radicals that really, really speed up aging, uh, and then smoker skin. Okay, so it can do a lot, it can treat a lot, and how does it do that? 
So we have five uh, technologies within this one system, and I'm going to go through them one by one. So first we have uh, Aqua B, and Aqua B uses a spiral vacuum and then specific solutions. So it's liquids uh, that's treating the skin. You can kind of think of that Aqua B is, um, I think, the most popular technology out there that most of us know is um, hydrofacial. And hydrofacial is just one standalone system with the Aqua B, really. I mean, that's not what they call it. We call ours Aqua B, but that's really all hydrofacial is, is that one step. And then we additionally have um, for other technologies, this next one, if you guys know the technology Oxygeneo, this is very similar to that, where we're oxygenating the skin with CO2 microbubbles, and then it also exfoliates the skin really well. Micro T is using a bipolar microcurrent. Collagen Plus is using dual bipolar radio frequencies. So there's four electrodes on the handpiece. And then Ultra B is using one megahertz ultrasound and we use specific serums with it to drive ingredients deep into the tissue. So why do we have all five of these technologies? The, the system pre-May was developed in Europe and the um, developer, the owner of the company, really sat and looked at um, everything that was out there, like Hydrofacial, like o Oxygeneo, like other companies that do something similar, and really scratching his head like, wow, there's no actual platform systems out there where we can take all of these facial hand pieces and put it into one platform to really be able to target all of the concerns that are out there. So it doesn't matter the patient's age, uh, the patient's skin type and the patient's condition, we have a solution for anybody that comes in. So when you think about this, I like to think about it as the layers of our skin. So our skin, it's very complex and there's multiple layers to it. So first we have the epidermis and within the epidermis, we have many layers. Um, but the biggest thing that I'm gonna talk about are keratinocytes. Those are the cells that turn over every 28 to 30 days. And those are the cells that generate from the bottom of the epidermis and they move upward. And then eventually we end up with 15 to 30 dead skin layers um, at all times. And really there's a purpose for that, even though we don't like it, there is a purpose for that. And that's the most outer layer um, of the skin, which is called the stratum corneum barrier. So the big word is barrier there, right? There's a barrier to keep pollutants out, to keep debris, to keep um, you know, us safe from infection and bacteria in the sun. But when we have too much dead skin that builds up, that's what gives us just that overall dull complexion to our skin. Our skin just doesn't look vibrant and healthy. So we're gonna talk about those cells. Additionally, our melanocytes. Our melanocytes are located right at the bottom of the epidermis. And our melanocytes, that's what produces pigment. And there's a reason that they're located there because melanocytes, when they're activated by the sun, they produce pigment to help protect us from the sun, to help from the, the sun rays to get deep, deep, deep down into the dermis where our collagen and elastin is. Our collagen elastin is located in the reticular and papillary dermis which is located right below the epidermis. So here is the papillary dermis, and then here is the reticular dermis. So you can think of like your darker skin types, like skin type fives and sixes. They have natural sunscreen really built into their skin for a reason. It's to protect the underlining layers of the skin uh, so they don't break down. Because that's what really gives us our thickness to the skin, uh, keeps our skin really tight, uh, keeps our skin, um, allowing our skin to have that natural bounce back to it. That's all located in that deeper dermis. And then below that, we have the subcutaneous, which is where our fat lies. And then right below that is our muscle. So now talking about why do we have all five of these hand pieces, kind of think of it as they are all targeting a different layer of our skin because different layers have different concerns. So for example, we need exfoliation on the most outer layer of our skin to remove those dead skin cells. Um, we need hydration in the dermis because we have a lot of 
this is my favorite word to say, glycosaminoglycans are located in the dermis. And I think the most popular one that you guys would know is um, hyaluronic acid. And that gives us our overall moisture to our skin, yes, but it also gives it our turgidity. Turgidity is that natural kind of plumpness to our skin, that natural bounce back, kind of like what elastin gives, but in a very different way. Um, so it's important to keep that hydration in the skin so we don't have that sallow look. And then skin tightening, that's coming from the dermis as well. That's where our fibroblast cells are. And fibroblast cells are the cells that produce collagen. And then muscle toning is really important as well, just to get that, that toned appearance to, to our skin. Strengthen the jawline, strengthen the cheekbones, strengthen the muscles around the eyes. So we'll break down how we're doing that one by one. I'm gonna put my clothes on because I can't see all that well. I was hoping I wouldn't need them, but I do. Okay, much better. So the first step we're gonna talk about is Aqua B. So Aqua B is deep cleansing, exfoliation, hydration, and nourishment. So it does a lot. And again, this step is very similar to what you know, um, which is the hydrofacial. Mo most of us have heard about the hydrofacial, kind of know what it is. And what it's doing is it's using vacuum suction. It has a very strong vacuum to it, which is really important because when we start to work on people that have really congested skin, usually our congestion is in the T-zone, mostly around the nose area. And with that strong vacuum, we can really suction out all the congestion in the area. But before we do that step, the first step is cleansing. Then we remove impurities then we put nourishment back into the tissue. So how we're doing that is the different solutions that we're using. Uh, sorry, I didn't open up that slide all the way. So um, first up, like I said, deep cleansing. It's not, you know, if I came in to you right now with a full face of makeup, you wouldn't just go in and like cleanse my makeup off. You still want to cleanse the patient, make sure the skin is, is clean and and uh, free of, of makeup, lotion, sunscreen, things like that. But cleansing is more that deep cleansing of the tissue, um, really getting rid of like the oil and the debris on the skin. And then um, the next one is going to be the impurities. And then the next one is going to be the nourishment. So quick video, and then I'll talk about the solutions, just so you can visualize what that handpiece is doing. So just so you can have a visual of what the handpiece looks like and kind of what it's doing. So now we'll talk about the solutions. So step one is the cleansing and we're using uh, lactic, ac lac <laughs> lactic acid, uh, panthenol and hyaluronic acid. So the biggest active ingredient here, all of them are active ingredients, but the biggest one to really get in and do a deep cleansing of the tissue is the lactic acid. So it just breaks up all of the impurities in the area, breaks up all of the debris, which is great. When it breaks it up, then we go in with the second solution and that is using salicylic acid. So, and neosinamide as well, but the biggest active ingredient here, again, all of them are, but the salicylic acid is kind of think of it like a peel to the skin. And that's what it's doing. It's going in and really removing all of the congestion in the area. So typically with step one, we're treating the full face. Step two, we are just treating the congested areas typically in the T-zone. So around the chin, around the nose and the forehead. A lot of times they don't need it here. Of course, if they're acne prone, then, then you can do it on the, on the cheek area if they're, if they're really needing it. And what's great is that we have different tip sizes. So we're using a larger tip size to cleanse the skin so we can do it quickly. And then we put on a smaller tip for step two. So, and it's actually kind of angled here. We'll go back to the photo of it. There's an angle to it. And that angle is important because it's allowing us to really get in and scoop all of the uh, congestion out of the skin. And then step three is to nourish the skin. So after we've done the deep cleansing and then we've used salicylic acid to kind of peel the skin and to break up that debris, we're going in and nourishing with uh, panthenol, um, hyaluronic acid, and making sure that their skin isn't dry after. Okay, 
So, and then step four is just to cleanse the handpiece out to get ready for the next patient. All of this is about a 10 minute process, really quick, nice and easy. All of these are um, right around, I would say five to 15 minutes at the most. So you can use all five hand pieces in an hour, which is amazing. If you want to extend it um, a little longer, you absolutely can as like an experience. And I'll talk about um, something really exciting that we have with this handpiece where you can make it more of that facial experience if they, if they want it. Um, or you can of course customize it to your patient that's really busy. Okay, I can get out of here, great, you can do the treatment quick. Okay, so our next handpiece is Vibrox. Vibrox uses CO2 microdermabrasion. The handpiece actually vibrates and there's a reason for that. And it also has a red LED light, which red LED is just for overall healing and enhancement of collagen. So what we are doing is we're using different, I think I have this for my next slide. Yeah, I'll, I'll wait till I get to my next slide. Um, but we're using uh, different gels with the handpiece. And when it vibrates, then it creates a bore effect. And the vibration and the gel start to create little CO2 bubbles, which penetrate into the skin. Where this is important is that we're actually oxygenating the tissue. So hemoglobin, we're, we're getting circulation to the tissue and you can actually visually see it. And with that circulation, then hemoglobin, because blood brings overall nutrients and oxygen to the skin. And when you oxygenate, tissue, it just re-energizes our skin. And it also responds better to everything else you do after. So when you oxygenate it, you get the nutrition, you get oxygen to the skin, we get microcirculation to the tissue. Now we have overall healthier tissue for when we go in and do uh, things like radio frequency after. So think of it kind of like a prep to the skin, but it also does a really good deep exfoliation of the tissue. So where this is important is your acne prone clients, um, someone like me who's very oily, um, has a lot of uh, buildup of dead skin cells, um, has enlarged pores. This is, not, this is um, a step that you can absolutely skip with your older clientele who's very dry, who have very thin skin. You don't have to do this step, but it's great for someone like me, oily and acne prone. Okay, I'll show you the hand piece. And how it works. Vibrox CO2 microdermabrasion and vibration combined with red LED light. This special handpiece produces countless CO2 microbubbles to increase natural oxygen delivery to the skin. Okay, so sorry, it's very short, uh, but you can kind of see it vibrates and it creates those little CO2 bubbles. Vib okay, so we have two different gels that we can use with this handpiece. One is bright, the other one is fresh. So bright is going to be for your patients who have a lot of sun damage. I forgot to mention that this handpiece is great for, for them as well. Because with a lot of sun damage, those melanocytes have produced too much pigment and that pigment has traveled, it's not just deep in the epidermis, but it's traveled all the way through the epidermis. So the more exfoliation we can do, the more pigment we can remove. And additionally, we are using a gel with a tyrosinase inhibitor, which is the alpha arbutin. Alpha arbutin acts in the cell to really tell the melanocyte, hey, slow down, don't produce pigment. And then additionally, we're exfoliating with the little pod. And the pod becomes more abrasive the longer you use it. So with this, we're always starting um, with this handpiece around the eyes because it's, it's gentle when you first start. And then as you go, it gets more and more abrasive. So when you get into um, more of like the problematic areas, like the cheeks, which for me are my, my biggest pore areas are my cheeks, my nose. This is where you wanna do more of that exfoliation. Or if they have a lot of sun damage, always start around the eyes. And then as it gets more abrasive, go into those troubled areas where there's a lot of pigment um, or like melasma, things like that. Um, and then if 
you're, if they're not needing bright, they don't have sun damage, then you would use the fresh kit, which is for overall just anti-aging. So it's using aloe vera, it's using hyaluronic acid. And again, that's a very important glycosaminoglycan to have in your skin to get that natural bounce back, just to look overall healthy. And you're getting that glowing look when you have more hyaluronic acid in the skin. So you have an option between the two, or you have, if you, if you don't wanna do the exfoliation process, then we have a massage tip that you can use. So you can make it an experience for them. Let's say they're an older um, client, really thin skin, you can't do this aggressive exfoliation on them, then you can do a massage for five minutes or so. Or if they are a client that is oily, that does has, has sun damage, that does um, have acne prone skin, you can still do the massage to really make it that really nice facial experience. Okay, so next one is micro T. So micro T is using bipolar microcurrent. And what this is doing is it's going deep into the muscle. So it's helping to stimulate um, muscle toning. All of these hand pieces are very, very comfortable. This is not something that is, that's ever gonna be really uncomfortable for the patient. This one is the exact same way. They may have a little twitch here and there, um, which is great because you know you're really getting to that muscle and you're really stimulating it, um, but it's never gonna be uncomfortable for them. The consumable on this one is just regular clear ultrasound gel. So I'll show you uh, the hand piece. Micro T bipolar microcurrent uses tiny electrical currents to stimulate facial muscle and tighten and smooth skin texture. Okay, so going deep, you can see there's just those two electrodes, and where are we using it? So with the microcurrent, and I, do, I don't have a slide like showing the, the face, but I'll show you here on the screen, where we're using it is the jawline to really help strengthen the jawline. We're using it on the cheekbones, again, to help strength, strengthen the cheekbones. These are all the areas that people really want to be pronounced on their face. Uh, we are taking it right below the brow and above the brow, we're working in a vertical direction here and we're working in a horizontal direction here to stimulate these muscles to help lift. Kind of like what that Botox effect does, how um, you can lift the brow with Botox. It's doing the, this really the same concept by working on these muscles. Okay, next one we have is Collagen Plus, which is using dual bipolar radio frequency. And what does radio frequency do? So the hand piece, it's really nice because it has lights. It's right here, right where the, um, the power button is on the hand piece and the plus and minus. Um, this is great because it makes it very easy for the operator. If you want to increase the intensity, if you wanna increase the vibration of the Vibrox, if you want to increase the flow of solutions or the vacuum uh, with the aqua B, if you wanna increase the intensity of the microcurrent for muscle, or for this one, if you wanna increase the intensity of heat with radio frequency, you can control it all by just the hand piece. You don't have to spin around and, and use the system. Um, and what's really nice too, is that it has LED indicators. So you know if you're at the proper temperature or not. So when you first start working on the skin, it's going to be green um, and then, or I'm sorry, it's going to be blue. And then once you get to temperature, it will go from blue to purple. When it's green is when you don't have contact on the skin. So green is no contact, blue, you have contact, you're just not at temperature yet. And then as soon as it turns purple, you're perfectly at temperature. So what temperature do we need to reach in order to stimulate those fibroblast cells I was uh, speaking of? And that's 39 to 42 degrees Celsius. Once we get the temperature, the tissue to that temperature, that's when fibroblast cells are stimulated. And fibroblast cells are located deep in the dermis. So this does have the ability of going deep where they are into the papillary and reticular dermis. And once we stimulate fibroblast cells, then it goes through the process of neocollagenesis, 
these fibroblast cells sense that there's an injury on the skin, which it's a controlled injury. It's not like we're damaging the skin. It's in a controlled way. And then the fibroblast cells start to secrete collagen fibers and it breaks down old collagen that we do not need, that's not doing us any good, and it's stimulating new. Where this is very, very important too, is once we hit about 40, I'm 41 now, our collagen production almost completely stops. So it's important at my age and beyond to keep stimulating those fibroblast cells to keep producing healthy collagen and breaking down the old that's really causing us problems like fine lines and wrinkles, like laxity to the skin. Uh, this one's incredibly uh, comfortable, even though it's using heat, it feels kind of like a warm massage. And then here is the hand piece. Collagen plus megahertz. Radio frequency energy only moves up the skin to 39 to 42 degrees centigrade. This feature is used to encourage the natural production of collagen to keep the appearance of youthful skin. Okay, and then our last hand piece is Ultra B. So Ultra B is using one megahertz of ultrasound. What this is doing, and this one is a really nice last step to, to the full facial experience because it's just really nice and warm. Um, it is incredibly comfortable like the other ones are. And why it's so important for a last step is that it's taking ingredients and it's driving it deep into the skin. So we are using um, an active serum. When we do that, it creates micro channels in the skin. So the serum is able to penetrate through those micro channels and deep into the dermis where we want these active ingredients. So really it's just giving us our hydration back. It's using panthenol, it's using hyaluronic acid. Uh, and I thought I had description of all of those on here, but I'm not there. It's on the next one. Okay, I won't, I won't speak too much. So we're using ultrasound, it's heat. They feel mild heat, but what it's really doing is opening up uh, channels in the skin to drive the serum deep. So first I'll show you the hand piece and then I'll explain what the serum is made of. Ultra is one megahertz high frequency thermal ultrasound that assists transdermal absorption of active ingredients. Ultra B improves moisture retention and contributes to healthy skin appearance. So really you're just nourishing the skin after you've you know, cleansed and exfoliated and removed impurities, then we're just giving it a boost of, um, of uh, moisture. So panthenol moisturizes the skin by decreasing trans epidermal water loss. So it kind of creates a barrier on the skin and it also helps to lock in the hyaluronic acid. So hyaluronic acid, again, it's one of those glycosaminoglycans that we naturally have in our skin, but a lot of us just don't have enough of it. And like I was saying earlier, especially now in the winter, especially where I live in the desert, we just never have enough. We're really never hydrating enough, even with water. So um, this is just going to add the hydration that we're needing, which is going to in turn um, give the skin an, a, a plump appearance, a firm appearance and smooth. And then that panthenol helps to lock it, all of that in because it creates a barrier on the surface of the skin. Um, and then we have vitamin E, which is an anti-inflammatory, really important for us to use anti-inflammatories on our skin uh, because of just our our, the way that we live in general, right? We have so many free radicals. We have so much pollution. A lot of us are not that great in the sun where we should avoid it as much as we can. We, we don't always you know, have that option. So there's all kinds of just things that are happening to our, to our tissue and those antioxidants like vitamin, um, vitamin E just really help to overall protect our skin from all of that uh, damage that, that's happening in the world, the things that we just can't uh, escape. And then glycerin. Glycerin is to make sure that these ingredients don't evaporate before they're pushed really deep into the tissue. So when you're done and all of those amazing ingredients are deep in the dermis, 
all that's left on the skin is the glycerin, everything else it has um, has absorbed into the skin. So just a little bit amount of, of glycerin that also helps to glide on the tissue when you're using the handpiece. So here is uh, just a couple before and after photos and these are immediately after. So again, it's one of those systems that you're not gonna look uh, worse before you look better. We all know we're in the industry that so many of the things that we're doing, we're like, okay, we have to tell the client or patient, listen, it's you're gonna look, you know, you're gonna have marks on your skin or the pigment's gonna be even darker before it lightens. Um, you can wear makeup to, to cover it up. This is opposite of that. This, you're just glowing after, you look younger after, you look brighter after. Um, and the skin, you can see, it just looks healthy. It's no longer dull and dry and it's glowing. So same with her. And then another one immediately after. And then of course, the results when they've done a series, like if they have, um, acne that they're trying to get under control, if they have overall aging that they're wanting to reverse, if they have scarring that they want to get rid of, um, they have a lot of sun damage, so on and so forth. As they're doing these treatments monthly, then there's a much bigger dramatic difference in your before and after photos. After they've done you know, a series of four to six treatments, there's a big noticeable difference. Um, what's also amazing is there is uh, pretty much a limitless um, amount of like different protocols that you can use. So, you know, you can just do Aqua B on a patient or you can do Aqua B in the microcurrent. You can do all five if you want. You don't have to do them in certain orders. You can do Vibrox first before you even do Aqua B where that's just gonna loosen up all the dead skin cells, the Vibrox is, and then you go in with your Aqua B to do an even deeper cleansing and deeper removal of impurities. So there's so much that you can do, which makes it, I think, a lot of fun. And also whoever is sitting across from you that's asking or needing these treatments, it's absolutely customizable to them. And then also different price range, right? If, if they can only afford a certain, certain amount, that's okay, you don't have to do all five. You can just do Aqua B as an example. Um, this is also a great one to have on a membership where you can have tiers that they can do um, one of the technologies, or if they wanna move up to the, the tier higher, they can pick two or three of the technologies. And if they wanna be at the highest tier, then they can do four to five technologies. So it's a really great one for membership. Not only um, is it great just for affordability for people in memberships, but this system is something that they can absolutely do monthly. It's not like they have to take a break. It's something that they can continue doing um, to really keep their skin just beautiful, glowing and, and looking great. Most of us should be doing facials uh, once a month anyways. Okay, so another great thing is, I'm gonna skip this slide and go to something different, is um, for the practitioner and for the client that the device is a smart device. What does that mean? It means that when you're choosing everything on the screen, and I'm so sorry, I don't think I have a, a photo of the actual screen. I need, to, I need to get that in my next PowerPoint. Um, but on the screen, it's going to ask a lot of questions. It's going to ask what condition they are um, needing to treat. So is it oily? Is it fine lines and wrinkles? Is it hyperpigmentation? So you'll choose the conditions that they have. You'll also choose what is their skin type? Are they dry? Are they normal? Are they oily? Um, you'll also choose what area of the body are you treating? Are you treating the face? Are you treating the hands? Because the system is not just for the face. You could do the neck, you could do the decollete. And what this is doing is it's charting all of their treatments for the practitioner, but also for the client. So I'm gonna talk about why that's a huge positive on the practitioner side. Not only is it charting everything that you have entered, but it's also keeping track of the amount of time you have used each individual handpiece. So at the end, it will tell you on this client that for her or him, the duration of the treatment was 43 minutes. 
the solution time. So you did step one of Aqua B for three minutes, step two of Aqua B for three minutes, step three of Aqua B for three minutes as an example. Now where this is really big is that this system is using consumables, right? It's using solutions, it's using um, gels and, and the little tips that you use with Vibrox. And if all of a sudden you're the owner of the, of the spa, med spa office, wherever you have your system, you're the owner and you look the end of the day and you're like, well, we only did five treatments. Why are all my solutions gone? You can go back and see, oh, this operator, this employee accidentally used Aqua B for 20 minutes when it really should have been, you know, three minutes in step one and it was 20 minutes. So you can stop that right away. And there's no other system out there that does this. And that's really important because it's going to save a lot of money, therefore generate a lot more ROI. So it's huge for the practitioner. It's really great just to keep track and make sure your operators are doing it the right way, um, that they're using like collagen plus for the, around, the right amount of time to get the biological response we need. Collagen plus is using radio frequency. We have to get to a certain temperature, but also for a certain period of time to really stimulate fibroblast cells. You can see, are they doing it the right way? Uh, so really great for the practitioner to, to um, ensure that, you know, the consumables are not being wasted. And then for the client, it will also print out exactly what you've done for them. So um, what their skin is like, dehydrated, oily, what conditions they came in for, dehydration, hyperpigmentation, and they can have a printout um, of this. So it's just kind of like a nice little perk uh, for the client if, if you want to do that. All right. Um, so this slide, I think, yeah, it's one of my last slides. Let me check the time. Oh, I'm doing fine on time. Um, okay, so the revenue. This one can generate a lot of revenue. Uh, treatments can range depending on how many ham pieces you use on that client. Again, you can have memberships, tiered memberships, um, but the range is typically about 200, 150 at the low end. Uh, maybe you're just using Aqua B, all the way up to 400 to 500 if you're using all of the ham pieces. So your revenue, your ROI is generating, like here, how we did uh, the analytic, analytics on it, 83,000 per year with just two treatments. Uh, what does that say? I'm in the way, my camera. Um, okay, potential revenue of minimum 83,000 per year with just two treatments per day. Uh, so really, you're, you're generating a lot of money with this system, again, because it's customizable to the patient. There's no one that you have to turn down. Anybody can, can uh, have the treatments with this technology. Um, let's see, I think I, I spoke about most of these things, all skin types and indication suitable for the face, eyes, hands, neck, dec decollete. You can do the back if, if they have back acne. Um, you can do the abdomen if they have um, stretch marks or scars. Really, you can treat anywhere on the body. It doesn't have to just be um, from here up or the hands. Uh, complementary to existing. Yes, you can prep the skin with Aqua B and with Vibrox and then go in with anything else you have to offer in, in your office with your high-powered radio frequency, your high-powered IPL, your high-powered lasers, um, anything that you're doing, this just complements that. It's that first step of prepping the skin for anything else that you're doing. And again, if you're using these higher powered technologies on the skin and they may have like a little downtime and they're coming in monthly and now they're done with treatments, they may not wanna go through that again. So you can just maintain their skin with this, with just Keep like a, a nice facial every month will help maintain those results uh, without having to go, you know, really through any downtime at all. Um, okay, and I spoke about memberships. It's really ideal to, to hold a membership with, uh, with the pre-May. Marketing materials are already created. So we already have roll-up banners for your front office. Uh, patient flyers to really answer all questions for them, um, to really get them to ask like, hmm, what is this? I want to try it. 
And that is all I have. I cannot believe I got through that in less than an hour. I think this is the first webinar I have ever done in less than one hour. All right, so um, I do want to give you guys um, some information. So if you have any questions at all, uh, you can always email us. Clinical, clinical questions is clinical. USA at Sinclair.com. Um, marketing questions, it is marketing.usa. Wait, did I do the clinical one right? Clinical is clinicalusa at Sinclair.com. Marketing is marketing.usa at Sinclair.com. Um, or you can always go to our website, uh, or you can always call us if you have any questions. And the number is 888 888- 415-1192. And we're here to answer any questions that you have. If you already have the system, I'm sure you're absolutely over the moon and you're loving it. Um, but again, if you have questions on like technique, things like that, you can always email us. We can always jump on a, on a Zoom call and help you in any way. Um, if you don't have the system and you get it, I know that you're going to absolutely love it. Clients love it. There's not a single person who has tried it and said, nah, I mean, truly your skin is just gorgeous right after the treatment. It's uh, it's a really phenomenal high uh, revenue technology. All right, you guys, thank you so, so much for joining. And uh, I look forward to seeing you guys on the next webinar. Thank you.